We are lost. Super nervous. Let's see your finger. I want to just have the same doctor. I don't know why he's being referred to a specialist. Family, we are lost. Like we made an appointment because we're doing um, distant learning and they still have to take the pictures. I parked my car so far behind because we took Google map and it led us into like warehouses. I think this is the place. Picture. This was your second student picture mm -hmm. for second grade? Yes. And what, what do we have to do differently? We had to drive here, didn't we, to take yeah. your pictures? And since the road was closed, uh, we had to walk. We did have to walk and I thought we were lost and we were late, but did we make it? Yes, we did. We did make it. So yeah, family, Ashton officially has his school pictures, so that's exciting. Yeah. <laughs> and then I didn't know, but he was missing last year's picture because they closed the school, so. I'm glad that we at least got this picture done. We only got lost a little bit. We had to walk like a bunch of warehouses down, but we made it. Yes. All right, family, so we made it back. Um, we were just kind of going to do like a day in the life of Lethal Medic's family um, with distant learning and having to run errands and then having the new baby. But I just got this voicemail. Um, and I told you guys I'd keep you guys posted. You know how Lethal fell? Lethal, be careful. Oh. Bro, be careful. Oh, are you okay? Are you okay? okay Here, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. And he hurt himself. Um, we did get x-rays. We didn't know how to read the x-rays. Lethal did see like a line. Remember the x-rays yeah. he showed you? There was like a line at the top of his pinky, but it didn't look like anything was really broken. I don't know if you can see on the very, very tip top, there's like this little teeny line that's at the very tip. We didn't think anything like bad from what we saw, other than the swelling. Like we thought maybe it was going to be another twist, kind of like his foot yeah. or his, his toe. But the doctor just called me when I was with Ashton getting his pictures done. And hold on, I'll just let you guys listen to this. A few hours later. He fractured his little finger. Bruh. He fractured it. They confirmed that they got the x-rays. They're referring him over to another doctor and he fractured his little finger. So um, we have to go to this orthopedics uh, appointment. I'm going to have to get Letho ready. Um, I don't think he knows that like it's fractured. I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna call the doctor's office right now. I'm gonna ask him why they're referring Letho out to the orthopedic, which is like a bone doctor. And if there's something that they saw in the x-rays that we didn't see because I don't understand why they would have to refer him to a different doctor. Yeah, why don't they just have the same doctor? Yeah, why wouldn't why would they just say, hey, he did fracture his finger, come back into this doctor's office? So I don't know why he's being referred to a specialist. I'm going to call them. I'm going to keep you guys posted and updated and let you guys know. And I'm going to have to tell Lee, though, that he's going to have to go to a specialist um, for his pinky. And hopefully we can find out what's happening. And um, hopefully it's nothing bad. Yeah. All right, family. So I called uh, my son's doctor back and asked him why he has to see a specialist, why he can't just go back to the, his doctor's office. Like, is there something I need to be concerned about? And I guess where the fracture is, is in a particular area in his finger, the growth pellet. And he needs to see a specialist because they need to know if, if he needs to have surgery. So um, I just thought he hurt his finger. I didn't even think it was fractured. And now knowing that it's fractured and it's in a particular area that he may need surgery, I mean, I hope, I'm just, you know, if it has to be done, then it has to be done. So we're just going to make an appointment with the um, orthopedic. We're going to go see the specialist and we're going to see what they say.
and we're gonna go from there, family. So, I don't know how I'm gonna break the news to Letho. So me and Ashton came home. We were gonna tell Letho that his doctor called and that we need a specialist to come look at his finger. However, Letho wasn't there. He was at a friend's house. I called Letho, told him to be ready because I'm gonna pick him up. I'm here at his friend's house. I'm gonna call him right now, let him know that I'm here because I have to prepare him. When I called the specialist, they already had me make an appointment. Lito? Yeah. yeah. Hey, um, I'm here. Alright, I'll see you in a little bit. Let me get my back. Okay. So I already made an appointment with a specialist. I just got done telling my husband to. Oh, here it comes Lito. But we gotta tell Lito. I don't know yeah, we, me and Ashton started a video, like a day in the life of Lethal Maddox. Oh. Yeah, since we have, you know, Maya's new clothes and everything like that. But actually, well, come up here. I have to tell you something. How was your day so far? It was good. My finger hurt a little bit when I was playing Legos with my friends. Oh, your finger's hurting. Mm -hmm. We actually got a call from your doctor. What did she say? Well, she saw the x-rays. What did she say about the x-rays? Um, well, she said that there's a, um, that your finger's fractured. What does that mean? Is it, like, broken or something? It's not necessarily broken. It's just, like, there's a crack in the bone. Can they fix it? I think they can fix it, but, well, that's the other thing is, is after she called me, she didn't just call me to tell me that there was a fracture. She said she's referring you to a specialist. What, so what can the specialist do? Well, that, I called the specialist and they made an appointment for you, like, as soon as possible because I guess where you broke your finger is in a place called the growth palate and it can cause deformities if it doesn't get straightened. So the specialist informed me that you may be going in... I don't want to scare you or anything, but you might go into surgery. What will the surgery do? Like, will, if I do have to go to surgery, will you be in the surgery room with me? I I, I don't think I'll be in the surgery room with you, Lito. But I don't know. I'm like, there's a lot of questions if it does or doesn't need surgery. So I don't even know if it needs surgery. We're going to find out everything tomorrow. But I just want to let you know because you need to take really good care of your finger until then. So we just need to take it easy. Now, like, don't be worried or anything. We're just going to have to go to the appointment and see what they say, Lito. And we're going to have to keep Lito and Maddox's family, like, um, we're going to have to update them on the situation. But don't be worried. I don't want to worry you or anything. It's a possibility, but we're not sure yet, okay? So we're going to keep you guys updated. We were going to do a day in the life of Lito and Maddox's family. We'll probably have to do that video another time. Um, we're going to film what happens tomorrow when we go see the specialist. All right, you guys. So as you guys know, the doctor called us and she told us, like, um, I want you to go in and see the specialist. It's the orthopedic because where Lito fractured his pinky. It is on the growth palate. Mm hmm And since it's in that area... Unless he sees a specialist and gets it fixed, it may cause, um, like a... Deformity. Yeah, in his pinky. So we have to see the specialist and see what they're going to do. But they did go ahead and tell us to prepare for surgery because lethal might need surgery um, to fix this. I, I honestly didn't know that, you know, if you fracture your pinky, they would give you surgery, but... That's what we've been informed. Hopefully I don't have to have surgery. And if I do, I'm super nervous. I never had the surgery before. Um, yeah, you haven't. If you guys have had surgery, comment down below. Um, let us know um, how it went. Because um, Lisa really has on surgery. I don't, I think they're just, I don't know. I don't know if they would put you like under or if they would just like numb your hand and operate on your finger. I have no idea. So as you can see, like there's that bone, like it's got swollen. That's why we made the appointment compared to this finger. And then, um, it's actually the nail itself is turning black. 
So I don't even know if the fingernail it might fall off or something. But yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna drive there. Wish us luck. I know Lito was really nervous. He was really nervous this morning when we were getting ready to go. But I think you're gonna be okay. We're gonna find out everything and we'll know once we get there. And hopefully your finger's okay. High five me with the other hand. <laughs> All right, family, wish us luck. So family, we just arrived at the orthopedic. Um, got to put on my mask. We're gonna find out if he's going to indeed need to have surgery or if there's an alternative way that they can help with the fracture. But because where it's at, they, pro they think that he probably will need to have surgery. So wish us luck. We're gonna try to film as much as we can on this journey. Um, I know he's super nervous about this. family we're waiting in here. Yeah, I am super nervous. Let's see your finger. Yeah. The ball. Yeah, it's very good. Get to the cellar pinky. Are you nervous? I am super nervous. Let's see. Yeah. Let me see the other pinky. Oh yeah, there's a big difference. I won't get this pinky up because I'm scared that the nail might fall off. The nail is black. So we're just waiting for them to call out our names and wish us luck, family. Wish us luck, Lita. Good luck. All right, you guys. Looks like Lita got a new cast. We're going to have to explain more as we go out. We're going to be checking out right now and we'll tell you guys what happened and what Lita's going to get done. Family, I just got back from the doctor's appointment. They gave me this brace. Mom. I have to visit them in two weeks. If the fracture doesn't heal within two weeks, they said I might have to have, to have surgery. But the good news is, right now, at the moment, I don't have to do surgery. But we won't know until two weeks and if I do. If I do, family, I am going to be super nervous. I just don't know what I would do if I had to do surgery. Nope. Uh, I would have to quit a lot of things because a lot of things involve my hands. Family, comment down below if you've broken your hand or any bone. And family, like, subscribe. Shoutouts will be at the end. Bye.